Hello Primary 7s and welcome to Calderside Academy. My name is Mr Neil and I'm going to take you on a tour today of the music department. Let's check out one of the classrooms. Here we are sat in one of the classrooms here in the music department. As you can see, if you have a look around, we've got some guitars, keyboards over here, even a drum kit behind me. This is because you get a chance to play all of the classroom instruments, such as the drum kit, acoustic guitar, bass guitar, Keyboard. and we'll do a mix of practicing on our own and playing together as a class. You'll also get the chance to learn about some of the theory behind music and listen to lots of different examples. So here we are in one of the other classrooms. Now you'll notice that this one's got some computers behind me unlike the other one. And that's because in this room you'll get the opportunity to learn about music technology. Music technology is anything to do with recorded sound. So think about recording albums, sound for film, sound for video games, all of the other stuff in between. We have some special equipment in here, such as this little box down here, which allows us to plug microphones in and for the computer to recognise and record them. And that's something you get a chance to do when you come here to Calderside. So over here we have some of our practice rooms. This is where you get a chance to go into a room, practice by yourself, refine your skills that you learn here. Or of course this is where we have our music lessons. We have some great instrumental teachers here at Calderside and they teach out of these rooms. Let's check one out just now. So here we are inside one of the practice rooms. As you can see we've got some of our big xylophones as well as a piano and a nice practice space for you to come and refine your skills. Over at this side of the corridor we have our drama department. Let's check out the classroom. So you'll notice that it's a lot darker in this classroom and that's because we have all these stage lights and that's to light you up when you're performing. You spend two periods a week in music but for one of those terms you'll come to drama once a week. That gives you an opportunity to build on all of your dramatic skills such as performing, team building, and communication. We're now going to head down and meet Mr Smythe, who's going to take you through a quick music lesson. Hi folks, Mr Smythe here. Um, so just going to give you a quick demonstration on how to play Pirates of the Caribbean. Um, so what you can do is if you don't have a keyboard at home, um, you can download a keyboard app on most devices, or if it's on a laptop or a computer as well, then you could get um, keyboard websites um, where you can get access to the actual keys themselves. Uh, obviously it'll be a wee bit easier um, if it's maybe on a tablet device, um, like an iPad or something like that as well. So let's just go over what we're going to do here. So first of all, we're going to have our point finger. We've got five fingers here. Finger number two first, our point finger, and we're going to go to F. Now if you don't know what F is, we can see on the keyboard there are sets of two keys and sets of three keys. So we go to the set of three, and it is the white key that is directly before the set of three. So set of three, and it's the white key here. And then pretty much all of your fingers, one finger per key, is everything where it needs to be. So it ends up actually being your thumb on E, but we're not going to start with that one. So point your finger on F. And then, as the music is on the page with the letter names on it to help you, then I'll just guide you through it. So we're going to go F, G, A, G, F, E. So that's the first wee bit. Because again, most of the notes are going to be underneath your fingers anyway. So we have, again, just let me go through it again. F, G, A, G. Now we've got quick notes, F, G, A, F, E, F, E. Right, so now we've got to the end of where we can go, because if we're going notes lower, da, 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 then I've nowhere else to go. So I'm actually going to cross over, so my thumb's on here, I'm going to cross over, and then everything's where it needs to be. And that's basically it, right? So I'm going to go through it again. So again, we're starting, find F, again, if there's letter names, but find an F, it's a set of three black keys, 
the white key just before it, point and finger, one finger per key, rather than kind of doing this. All right, so we're following the rhythm, so we're going F, G, A, G, F, E, F, G, A, hold, then F, G, A, G, F, E, F, cross over, C, D. And that's how we play Pirates of the Caribbean. Uh, hi, Mr. Smythe here again. Um, just to give you a quick demonstration of the drum kit, and it's something that you can work on at home. Um, not to expect everybody to have a drum kit, it's quite rare to have a drum kit actually, they cost a lot of money um, and are very noisy for the neighbours. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to demonstrate on the drum kit in case any of you are fortunate enough to have one and then I'll show you what you can do at home because you actually don't need a drum kit to learn how to play the drums. First of all actually what we're going to do is we're going to have a right hand over left hand. You know right and left, you got right and left, left is the one with the L, so our right hand is going to then go over our left hand at the drum kit. And again, we don't need a drum kit to do this. I'm going to show you something separately in just a wee minute. So right hand over left hand. And we're going to have tap and foot, which is my right foot, on the pedal down here. So tap and right foot at the same time. Then we're going to have both hands at the same time. And then we just repeat it. So we have tap and foot, both hands. Tap and foot, both hands. And this is the easy version of a rock beat, so it's rock easy. So tap and foot, hands. Now what we can do as well, so we can try and make that a wee bit more challenging, and we then double tap. So I can tap with using the word coffee, coffee. And every time it's coffee, I either have right foot or my left hand. So for example, coffee, 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 coffee. You can play it faster, you can play it slower. Right? And that's how quickly that you learn it as well. Now what we can also do, again if you don't have access to a drum kit, is we can just use our lap, we cross our hands, our right hand over left hand onto your lap, and we can just do the exact same thing. So tap and foot at the same time, so we go tap and foot, then both hands. Tap and foot both hands. Tap and foot, both hands. And that's the easy rock. But then, if we're doing the double tap, then it's the exact same, so nothing changes here. Foot, hand. But now I'm going to tap to the word coffee with my right hand. Coffee, 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 coffee. And that's literally how we play the drum kit. Don't need a drum kit for it. We have lots of different extracurricular groups for you to join when you come to Calterside. If you have a look behind me, you'll see that we have some big drums. Those are called taiko drums, and that's because we have a taiko drumming group here. If you don't know what taiko drumming is, I suggest you head over to YouTube and type it in, see what you can find. We have other groups as well, such as a ukulele group, a choir, a wee big band, a concert band, a brass group, and lots of others. So, as well as getting a chance to play all of these new instruments and develop all of your skills on listening and exploring new music, you also get the chance to do some performance while you're here. Every year we host a Christmas concert, we host school shows, the last school show they did was Pop Stars, the 90s musical. We have a show of excellence every year, which is a chance for you to show your achievement within the school. So I really hope you've enjoyed today's tour of the music department and the drama department. I hope you enjoyed Mr Smythe's quick lessons on the keyboard and the drums and we all really look forward to seeing you join us here at Calderside Academy.